Hello everybody, it's DMC3, and I'm here with my friend Jonathan to read the book of Matthew. Hello, how's it going everyone? I'm going to start reading from uh, chapter 1 of Matthew. A record of the genealogy of Jesus Christ, the son of David, the son of Abraham. Abraham was the father of Isaac, Isaac the father of Jacob, Jacob the father of Judah, and his brothers, Judah the father of Perez, and Zerah whose mother was Tamar. Perez the father of Hezron, Hezron the father of Ram, Ram the father of Aminadab, Aminadab the father of Nashon, Nashon the father of Salmon, Salmon the father of Boaz, whose mother was Rahab. Boaz the father of Obed, whose mother was Ruth. Obed the father of Jesse, and Jesse the father of King David. David was the father of Solomon, whose mother had been Uriah's wife. Solomon the father of Rehoboam, Rehoboam the father of Abijah, Abijah the father of Asa, Asa the father of Jehoshaphat, Jehoshaphat the father of Jehoram, Jehoram the father of Uzziah, Uzziah the father of Jotham, Jotham the father of Ahaz, Ahaz the father of Hezekiah, Hezekiah the father of Manasseh, Manasseh the father of Ammon, Ammon the father of Josiah, and Josiah the father of Jeconiah, and his brothers at the time of the exile to Babylon. After the exile to Babylon, Jeconiah was the father of Shiltiel, Shiltiel the father of Zerubbabel, Zerubbabel the father of Abiud, Abiud the father of Eliakim, Eliakim the father of Azor, Azor the father of Zadok, Zadok the father of Achim, Achim the father of Eliud, Eliud the father of Eliezer, Eliezer the father of Madden, Madden the father of Jacob, and Jacob the father of Joseph, the husband of Mary, of whom was born Jesus, who is called Christ. Thus there were fourteen generations in all, from Abraham to David, 14 from David to the exile to Babylon, and 14 from the exile to the Christ. Okay, so now we go to the birth of Christ. Now the birth of Jesus Christ was as follows. When his mother Mary had been betrothed to Joseph, before they came together, she was found to be with child by the Holy Spirit. And Joseph, her husband, being a righteous man and not wanting to disgrace her, planned to send her away secretly. But when he had considered this, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to him in a dream, saying, Joseph, son of David, do not be afraid to take Mary as your wife, for the child who has been conceived in her is of the Holy Spirit. She will bear a son, and you shall call his name Jesus, for he will save his people from their sins. Now, all this took place to fulfill what was spoken by the Lord through the prophet. Behold, the virgin shall be with child, and shall bear a son, and they shall call his name Emmanuel, which translated means God with us. And Joseph awoke from his sleep and did as the angel of the Lord commanded him, and took Mary as his wife, but kept her a virgin until she gave birth to a son, and he called his name Jesus. So, um, Mary was engaged, she was going to get married to Joseph, but then uh, she was with child, so Joseph was going to not marry her, but then, uh, so, but uh, he, he didn't want to publicly disgrace her, so he's going to do it quietly, because he, the Bible says, uh, because Joseph, her husband, was a righteous man, so after this, Joseph it's a dream, and uh, there's and, and there was an angel who told him, Joseph, 
do not fear that Mary will be your um, your wife. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, so God uh, had a plan here, right? And then, uh, so he, he still. And then, uh, so Joseph obeyed God, right? And uh, yep. He he still he still uh, married Mary, and. Uh, also, there's a there's a prophecy in here from uh, the book of Isaiah. It's fulfilled. It's um it says the virgin will be with child and will give birth to a son, and they will call him Emmanuel, which means God with us. So, right here, there's a there's this prophecy fulfilled that the virgin will be will be with child, and, and then there's this son who is going to be God with us. So God actually came to earth, dwelt among us. And um, the angel also says that he will save his people from their sins. So this is pretty, the angel's already talking about what Jesus is going to do on the cross for us. Come, He's come to die, die for our sins and take the punishment for our sins. Do you have anything to add to that? I'm tall, that's it. Mm -hmm. Chapter 1. Yeah.